Here are some general and Git improvements of the Eclipse IDE 2019-09. Improvements that have been added since the last release in June three months ago. To display shortcuts when they are invoked, for example for presentations like this one, there is a new option in the Keys Preferences page, which can be opened, as you can't see yet, by hitting Ctrl L twice. While activating it, you can see how the command with the corresponding key will be displayed. But for most of you, the next feature will be probably more exciting. Quick Search used to be part of the Spring Tools, has been contributed and is now part of the Eclipse platform. The Quick Search dialog can be opened via the Search menu or, as you can see now, thanks to the previous feature, via Ctrl, Alt, Shift, L. Search as a type makes Quick Search feel really fast, even without having an index of the content of all files. Enter the search string into the field on the left. An asterisk can be used as wildcard. The text field on the right can be used for a file name pattern. When a matching line is selected, the area below shows the matching line together with some lines above and below it. With a double click, you jump to the search result. To open more than one result in one go, choose the option Keep Open. In the Quick Search Preference page, you can configure which files should be ignored. For instance, everything in folders named Target will be ignored by default. The status line now shows, in addition to the row and column, also the offset of the cursor location. The offset starts with zero and includes line feeds and carriage returns in the count. This is helpful if, for example, a log file refers only via an offset to a location within a text file. When text is selected, the number of selected characters is displayed in brackets instead of the offset. Now, finally, the Compare Editor uses colors to display changes in both three-way and two-way comparisons. Added lines are shown in green, removed lines are red and changed lines are grey, which might contain added and removed characters in green and red respectively. Like already in Java launch configurations, there is now also a Show Command Line button in External Tools, Program, Launch Configurations. This gives you the full command line with the resolved variables. There are a bunch of minor usability improvements. For instance, in the Project Explorer, you can now close a project via a mouse middle click. Shorter dialog texts are faster to read. For example, in dialogs, like the Close Unrelated Projects dialog, Are you sure you want to? has been removed from the text, as it adds no value. Another minor improvement is that in the Preference page, General, Editors, Text Editor, items are shown with a configured color. In several places, the user interface responds faster than before. For example, when importing many projects, Select All and Deselect All is faster than in the past. For comparison, the same in Eclipse 2019-06, the previous release. That's clearly faster now, isn't it? The Git support has been improved as well. So-called lightweight tags can now be added to a Git repository by just leaving the message field empty. In the Git history view, there is a new button on the very right to show first parent commits only. This shows only merge commits but hides all other commits from merged branches. To avoid even more buttons in the Git history view, the filter buttons have been grouped together into a single button with a drop-down menu. 
Did you know that you can change the presentation in the unstaged and staged areas? The new drop-down button at the top of the unstaged area makes it easier and more obvious that the presentation can be switched between flat, tree and compact tree. Another minor but very nice improvement is that also the repository node can be selected instead of the deep nested specific branch node to rename a branch via F2. The user interface of Git has been improved in the same way as the platform by showing shorter dialog texts, by buttons labeled with verbs instead of OK, for example, to apply rewording of a commit message, you now have to hit reword instead of OK, and by improving the interactive performance in some cases. These were some of the general and Git improvements of the quarterly rolling release September 2019. The Java and Gradle improvements are shown in a separate video. If you have missed some versions, you might want to watch the previous videos too. Thanks for watching and happy coding!